Welcome back everyone. Today I've got a really simple but delicious recipe. I'm gonna be making some crepes with a lemon yogurt filling. And the best thing about this recipe is that the batter is done fully in the Vibe Blender, which means less dishes and it's gonna be a really smooth batter. So you're going to want to start this recipe about an hour ahead of time because this batter does need to rest. Now it's really simple. All of these ingredients go into the Vibe Blender at once and we're going to mix it all up on smoothie mode. To the blender jug, add one and a half cups of milk, two eggs, one cup of plain flour, three tablespoons of melted unsalted butter, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, one tablespoon of sugar and a pinch of salt. Put the lid on and blend on smoothie mode for around 30 seconds or until the batter is really smooth. After just 30 seconds, we've got a really nice smooth batter. Time to get this in the fridge. We're gonna let it rest for about an hour. While the batter is resting in the fridge, it's a great time to get going on that lemon and yogurt filling. Now it's just a matter of mixing everything up in the bowl, putting it in the fridge until we're ready to use it. To make the filling, add a cup of homemade yogurt to a bowl and mix in two tablespoons of honey, the zest of one lemon and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. The batter has rested now and I'm ready to cook these crepes. I'm gonna heat up this crepe pan and get cooking. Place your pan over medium heat and brush with a little bit of butter. For each crepe, pour about a quarter of a cup of batter into the center of the pan, quickly swirling to get the batter as thin as possible and spread evenly over the whole pan right to the edges. The crepe will be ready to flip when the top is all dry and the edges start to crisp. This will take somewhere between one and two minutes. Release the crepe with a thin spatula and gently flip. Cook the second side until the crepe is golden. This should take less than a minute. The crepes are all cooked up now and looking and smelling really good. I've got my homemade yogurt filling. Now I'm gonna roll these up, sprinkle with a little icing sugar and a little bit more of that lemon zest and they'll be ready to enjoy. Perfect sweet treat for entertaining, made with a little help from the Vibe Blender. We hope you liked this recipe this week and we hope you do give it a go for yourself at home. And if you do, then let us know how you go in the comments section below. If you haven't already, then hit subscribe to see more of Ella Valley Life recipes. If you enjoyed this video today, then give it a like for us and we'll catch you again soon with another great recipe.